Let's move to our tractor factory workshop one, assembly line. Here's our tractor factory. Okay, we should wear the helmet first. Uh, thank you. Thank you. We wear. We must wear the he helmet before we get into the factory. Okay, let's moving. You can see the tractor in here are mainly produced from uh, five, 50 horsepower to 130 horsepower, which is mainly responsible for our small horsepower tractor. And uh, the, t the series of these tractors are mainly for TB, TE, and TD series. These are the tractors just produced by the product line. Okay, we keep moving to the assembly line. You can see we are walking in this green line. This is a safe road line. And be beside our is the it's the car line. It means uh, the tractors after after producing the, the tractor will go about this line. Okay, let's keep moving. So here is our TE series tractor. That's that's a mainly for the orchard. It means the wheelbase is narrow. Let's move to the main street of this factory. This is a okay. We we may stop because this is a trans transmission platform. The the this product line is like a U shape. This U shape from that way the tractor uh, chassis online and use this transform platform the tractor from this side go on to this side so it's like a u-ship and usually this door is not open but we are we are visiting so it's open now okay You can see this is all automatically. From this side is the chassis online, and the first stop chassis online, and through a few of progress process, and they keep moving. You can see that's our our Euro pad tractor and mainly for the 50 horsepower and you can see the tractor in here with not the tabling because it's not the process that are the tractor uh, the tractor factory of this factory uh, the productivity is about 220 and 20 units per day it means uh, at the maximum of the production it will be five minutes to offline a tractor you can see when we get start get moving forward the tractor means uh, the components a loss, a less, yes.
compare this this factory to the workshop too. The di the main difference is the chassis. This chassis is smaller. And this product product line is also flexible. Okay, we move to the another side. You can see this is the engine on the chassis, yes. Okay. And in here it's mainly for the TB, TE and T D series of engine. We can see some engines and some gearbox and the front axle, rear axle on this chassis. We should put on some components on it. We can clear see clearly on the board. Yes, that's the process of this position. Such as here is is the wall assembly line. Multi-way wall assembly line, yes. And we have a set of workshop in here. We can find some uh, some spoiled and other key components in here. You may find this is the online processes, the right side, and the left side is the offline process. And this whole line is about the assembly line. Be behind this two, these two lines is the sub-assembly line. And behind this line also have the transmission product line. You can see over there. You can see the trans uh, transformation transmission product line in that way. After they finish the uh, assembly, they will give uh, give a uh, chassis in here. And after painting, that was a painting. That was a painting workshop. After painting, they will put a chassis on this product line. That's the chassis online. We can manual control it. Oh, you can see that? That's the tractor with offline. Yes, after this tractor uh, finish the testing and they will go on to the market. Okay, that's the end of this tractor factory workshop one. Let's move forward for our visiting. Here's the tractor I told you before in the orchard one. This is seven, 70 horsepower four wheel drive tractor. And this is like a third generation body with, um, with the dryer filter. Okay. And we may also find some ordinary ones such like this is the 550 horsepower four-wheel drive tractor the 50 horsepower and four-wheel drive tractor is as a star module in our in Lovo's track folio, tractor portfolio planning okay that's the they are testing okay that's the end of this factory 